Sea Fish RC back at it today. We're still bashing on the Vitavon uh, tie bar, um, tie bar replacement the plate. It was, but anyways, it's the tie bar and the base plate together. So we got them on uh, big mo, and we got them on old heavy. Uh, still beating on the Vitavon. Yeah. No, this is 2035. I actually think I'm gonna put the 25 on and see how it rolls. Um, XLX2, Castle, 2028, 1100, and uh, we're going to give her a rip, see what happens, see if we can pull it up today. Appreciate you guys checking it out. See when pull off a backflip. All right, so we officially lost the GoPro on the truck. Hard hit again. I mean, this thing's taking some landings, and I don't see anything broken. All right, so since we've ripped a hole in the body, we're gonna change cameras. Something is definitely it. slipping, but I mean, it's, it's not like I'm jumping a little tiny bike ramp either. I really like these tie bar plates from Vitavon, man. Those things are badass. I'll take it. Okay, so if that didn't break a bulkhead, I don't know what else can, to be honest with you. She boy. I mean, that's some pretty good landings today, fellas, and there's zero cracks. I'm digging it. I'm liking it. I got a diff gear slipping somewhere. I could have chipped one, it could have been landing awkward. You can hear it though. As soon as I hit that bump, that reverse in the air, you hear that clicking. Hear it.
<laughs> oh, damn. I don't remember. Good thing I got my handy dandy screwdriver set. Hard cartwheel, a couple of nose plants. And She's solid, boys. I'm pretty happy with that. I'll take it. For sure, I'll take it. I definitely got a diff gear going. Oh, yeah. She's hurting. Yep. So we got some bashing in. We beat the crap out of the, the tie bar plates. And uh, she seemed to hold up pretty well, fellas. I'm gonna lie to you, pretty impressed. Still working on a set of diff gears that won't break. So if you know a guy who knows a guy who's got a set, let me know so I don't have that no more. Hopefully it was a uh, pretty good footage today. Anyways, uh, bit of on. Check them out on eBay. I'll post the links on the video. WFO long arm, wide arm kit. I've been bashing on these for about two years now. Man, I love the I love the wide X Max. It's a completely different truck, without a doubt. Castle 28, 2028, 1100, on with the XLX2. We are running. We have the Rhino 6.2s. These things are cooked, but been a pretty good bash of battery. I like them, Rhino 6.2s. So uh, we'll go back, turn some wrenches, get the disc fixed. Um, everything seems to be doing pretty well, though. I mean, gears are holding up. I really like these gears, and I really, really like the uh, the tie bar plates. I mean. That's some pretty hard hits today. And Zero cracks in the lower bulkheads, which is quite amazing to be honest. There's Big Mo in all his glory with now Got a new hole in the hood. Um, but as I uh, show some support, I'd appreciate it. If not, cool, man. So thank you for stopping by.